Hello everybody, my name is Margablar and welcome to Exoptable Money. Now the name of this game may seem a little strange, but this game is actually the prequel to Presentable Liberty. You know that game that changed my entire perspective on life and reality? Well, this is the one that came first. It may be a little weird to call it a prequel because this came first and Presentable Liberty is actually a sequel to this game. Either way, made by the same guy and apparently I play as Dr. Money. You know that evil bastard from the first game who caused the illness that destroyed everything. What is this? That destroyed everything and- Whoa. Hey, money! 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 I got money! I don't know how to play this game. All I know is that the, the video is a little trippy, kind of H.R. Giger-esque. Okay. Whoa! Money's just flying out of the box! That's awesome! What does this do? Oh! <gasps> wow, I can make more money. So anyway, this game is kind of a lot like Cookie Clicker and it seems really simplistic and whatnot. That's cause it is, probably. And it may be slow going because I know that the pace of Presentable Liberty was a little bit slow, so I understand that this one is probably gonna be slow as well. So in the meantime, where it's going to take a long time to make money, cause I gotta make more money! Everyone wants to make more money! I'm going to be waiting, so, like Cookie Clicker. If you don't know what Cookie Clicker is, my god, don't look it up! Don't! Please, dear god, don't! I don't want to lose another to the, the internet! I played that game till I got trillions and trillions and quintillions of cookies. God, that game ate away at my life. And I'm not saying that this one is also gonna eat away at my life, but hey! Money is probably everything. Money is everything that I need to make happiness in the world. Money will survive through all troubles. Now, I don't know if if on here, like, all these questionable things, like, I know what happened in Presentable Liberty. Now, if you didn't understand what happened exactly in Presentable Liberty, Dr. Money, he had a scheme to make more money, and that was to create a virus that would cause people to buy his cure. If you create a virus and create a cure, this thought concept, this idea, has been presented in the world. Like, it's already a real-world idea. It's totally morally wrong in every sense of the word and completely illegal. It would be horrible to do. But if you could get away with it, you would create a need for a product while at the same time creating such a fervent need that everyone would want to buy it or everyone would have to buy it, or else they would die. Like, create a lethal enough virus that would cause people to want your damn cure, and then sell the cure at whatever price you want. You would literally make all the money in the world, and that's, like, that that that's the idea behind a lot of conspiracy theories, like the United States, or the medicine industry. They made certain viruses. They didn't. I'm not saying they did. I come, I, I'm not saying anything at all. I'm not a conspiracy theorist, but I'm just saying the theories exist. That it's, like, people say the possibility that it could happen exists. Oh, mail. I got mail! Madam Sinclair. Uh-oh. Ha- Hello! Hi! Thank you! I guess? I got Bill's version too! Okay. Alright. I am Madam Sinclair. Thank you, Madam Sinclair. I am so glad you stopped by to send me that one damn letter. What was the purpose, if you don't mind me asking? Excuse my theatrics, I feel like I should be fancy. Uh, I'm just gonna have to wait a bit longer. But anyway, what was I saying? Um... Uh, oh yeah, I'm not a conspiracy theorist! I think this is exactly what I was going for. I am not a conspiracy theorist! I am not the game theorist! I am nobody except for Markiplier, or known as Mark. And I sit in a room alone talking to myself, playing video games, but... There are these theories and these ideas, and the thought games are there, and it's interesting to ponder these ideas, but... The, the resulting chaos is like exactly what happened in Presentable Liberty, like the horrific situation of it all going wrong is exactly what happened. And the weird thing is like, it presented the worst case scenario, but also the worst person scenario to possibly do it. And to explore the idea that if you're morally 
You know, if your morals are low enough such that you would even contemplate, let alone execute the plan of creating a virus and then creating a cure and making people buy it at an incredible price, then I guess that same person would have no problem with selling organs to try to also cure your stupid disease that you created that's killing everybody in the entire world and ripping this guy apart. But then again, it might have all been a thought idea and maybe none of it in Presentable Liberty was real and maybe all of this is just an illusion crafted el oh so elegantly by the government and they're just trying to get at us. Ah, yeah, whatever, I don't know. I think I'm getting close to buying another. I bills very Version 3. God, this is gonna take a while. Cause I don't even think I have a way to, like, click. Like, I don't think me clicking does anything. Like, I'm pretty sure it just do by itself, but maybe, hang on. Oh, another letter from Madame Sinclair. Hmm. I see you are making money. Yes, of course I'm making money. Ugh, anything can make money with the right oil. Okay. I'm trying to click, but I, I really don't think it do. Do it do, is this making, wait. Oh, I think it do. Wait, I might, it might just be the placebo effect. I wanna say that this is making me more money, but I don't know. I want more letters from Madame Sinclair. Also, I wanna move this goddamn story forward. There's gonna be a lot of jumps. It's come to my conclusion that my clicking is doing absolutely dick diddly, so I shouldn't even bother. I might as well take a bathroom break while I'm waiting for all of this to go down, but my next purchase is going to be the little kitty cat, because if you look, the kitty cat costs a thousand dollars. I don't know what the kitty cat is going to be for, but knowing this game, it's probably going to be horrible and scar me for life. So warning everybody, you're about to have your heart broken all over again. Actually, I don't know, maybe this game is literally just cookie clicker, and there's no hidden meaning to it. But, knowing that it's sending me letters, I'm a Oh, here we go, here we go. Boop. Yay! I got a little itty bitty clicker cat to look for money! Bye bye kitty, you be good! You be good kitty, come back safe! Madam Sinclair, I used to make money too. Thanks Sinclair, that's so helpful to me! What can you do to help me make more money? Cause that's all I care about. Unless you're gonna tell me that money isn't everything in the world. Well then screw you, I don't care. Ugh. Bing bong, I have enough to buy coins. Whatever that means. I miss my kitty, wow. Oh, that's delightful, that's a lot of coins. That's speeding things up considerably. Screw the kitty cat. I don't screw the kitty cat. This kitty cat found 2,000 monies! Oh, bye bye kitty cat, I wanted to s you to stay a little bit longer so that I could pet you, but I've got all this money! Who needs friends when you have money? Good god, that is a lot of coins. Or is that ever am I wrong here? But this seems like an easy game! What can I do next? I guess I can get more bills, but the bills actually weren't what were really doing it for me. I think the coins are gonna be the one to go. I'm going to save up a little more until I can get the coins. I mean, my kitty cat found 2,000 bucks. Got it good. Well, it won't be much longer now. Till something happens, maybe Madame Sinclair is gonna send me another letter when I get to 3,000, which is going to be right about now. Yay! Madame Sinclair. Oh, let's see what Madame Sinclair wants to say to me. Are you my- Oh, don't play this bull with me. I don't have the emotions for it. I can't tolerate this sort of stuff. Are you my friend? I'm gonna say no! No! Absolutely not. I don't know who you are, lady, and I'm not gonna care about you, even though you're gonna send me letters and force me to care. No, Madame Sinclair, I have to draw the line somewhere. I don't know you. I just-, just okay. All right, okay, I'm just gonna wait for my kitty cat to be get back and then move on with my life. Yay! Oh my god, kitty found 4,000 monies! Oh, you're such a good kitty! Oh, I wish I could love you, but I kinda want you to go get more money because the longer you wait here, the less time you have to go find me money, so get gone, kitty itty bitty kitty. Oh man, I have a lot of money now. I think the best upgrade would be the money machine because then it would make all this come faster. So, oh, I could buy a background. I don't know what that does. 
But if it's anything like the cat, maybe it'll make me more money? Yay! Oh! That's not yay at all! Oh, that's not yay either! Those better be all thumbs and then some of those bait and mail. Ooh, that's actually kind of pretty. Oh, okay. I think I'll take this one. Kind of like the sun setting on humanity as I plot ever so deviously to destroy- I didn't need to buy the backgrounds at all, did I? I- mm, That was a waste of 8,000 monies, wasn't it? Damn it! And Sinclair didn't even send me a goddamn message! Blah! I think I'm gonna go- I think I'm gonna go get some food or something. It's taking a while. <clears throat> I actually switched to this one because it's kind of easier on the eyes, so maybe it'll be easier for you guys to watch. I don't know, maybe in the comments below it's gonna be a big war about which background I should have chosen and how I'm so wrong about my life. But this is what it is for now, so please bear with it. Oh, Kitty's back! I don't know why I'm so happy. Well, of course I know why I'm so happy. Kitty's back! You said you're good, Kitty. You can stay a little bit longer this time because I missed you. It gets kind of lonely in here when I'm just waiting for money to collect. Okay, so I'm gonna get another money machine. Oh, I can get more coins too, but let me read my mail. Ooh, Madame Sinclair. What? That was, that was blank! Wait, it was blank! Madame Sinclair! I'm not your friend! Maybe she heard me. Alright, Kitty, go find more money. Cause I'm gonna need it. Uh... That was weird. Oh, yay! Madam Sinclair is back, I guess! Sorry, I forgot to write something on my last letter. Oh, thank you! This one is so filled with content! I am so glad that you got back to me to remind me that you didn't send anything on the last letter! How could you forget something like that? Are you suffering from a terrible disease? No? Alright then. I guess it's just a waiting game again. But at least I'm getting money more quickly now. I need money to support more for my estate. To take care of all my horrific appetite of whores. I just realized if you look at the bottom of the money machine, it looks like two eyes are staring at me. Like, I don't know how long that's been there, but... It's either two eyes or nipples. Like, I, it, either one. It could go either way in that regard. Either way, I'm gonna stare at them. Ugh. Those are eyes. Definitely eyes. Ah! Hey! I get so happy when you come back, kitty! I'm just so lonely when you're not here! Oh, 10,000. Oh my god, I, I was I was hoping it was gonna be that much, because now I can afford the topazes! Yeah! Wow. Holy crap, that's a lot of topazes. Okay, kitty, I'm sorry, but you're gonna have to go look for more money, because I need more money. I need more oil. If I'm going to survive in this world, I need more. Huh? All right, back to my lazing about. Oh, it feels good. Ah. It's been a while since my kitty cat returned. Hope he's okay. Like, I, I wasn't keeping track of the time when how far away he was gonna be. Hope he comes back. Don't know where he goes to find all that money, so maybe... Uh. Okay, now I'm starting to get a little worried, cuz... Been a long time now. Cat hasn't come back. I guess I never really thought about where he was going. Or how he was getting all that money. My cat comes back. I know what this game is doing! I know it's trying to dick with me. I'm not, I'm not dumb. Even though this guy... Uh, even though this came before the other one. I, I guess I could buy another money machine. I was hoping to save up for a topaz, but that's gonna take a while. Probably better that I get a money machine anyway. This means faster money. Hello, Madam Sinclair. Do you want to learn about a new way to make money? Yes, yeah, sure! I hope it's not the idea I'm thinking you're thinking of, because that idea ain't good! That idea ain't good! I guess I could buy the coins. It's gonna be a while for the tin can anyway. Buy the bills. What do you got for me, Madam Sinclair? I suck. Don't you dare! You stay away from that cat! You stay away from that cat! Or you tell me where that cat is, because I haven't seen him for a while. It's been a long while since I've seen my kitty cat. Uh, 
I'm just trying to progress the story a bit here. Did you know that cats have more uses than you would expect? <laughs> Other than finding money! Oh, how would they possibly have another use besides finding me money? Please, tell me. I wouldn't expect them to have all that many uses, period, but hey, I'm intrigued. You have my curiosity, so let's go for it now. While I wait for my money to collect into my pockets. <laughs> I miss my kitty cat, yes I do. I miss my kitty cat, don't you too? What did you do with him? I'll kill you. No, I won't, but I'll create a virus and then create a cure and sell it to the people who got infected by my virus, and then the whole world is gonna die. Bills? Well, come on, lady, get back to me! Where's my cat? What did you do with my cat? Where's my goddamn cat? I miss my cat! I miss my cat, he was the best cat. I wish he was back today. Maybe then he will see the life that he missed and then I'll feed him once, cause I haven't since I got him. Uh-oh, it turns out I'm a bad cat daddy and I shouldn't be allowed to have cats. My name is Dr. Money and I don't know how to play the ukulele, blah, 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 blah. Mm. came back. I went away for a little bit. My cat's not here. At least I can buy more topazes or whatever the hell the tin can does. Like if I buy the topaz, I know it's just gonna be more money. Then again, more money's good, right? More money's great. More what is <gasps> no! machine and voila that's not okay oh oh what's worse is I'm gonna do it oh oh no! oh that's so horrible why is that a thing oh oh Oh, why is that a thing? Oh, I'm legit like really upset at that. That was horrible. That was flip dick and horrible. Oh my God. Here I was worried about my cat and you freaking killed it and then I'm, I'm putting, I'm making, uh. uh. Here I thought the game was gonna make me care about the letters, but then again, you know, it's like, oh my god, Madam Sinclair, you are an evil, evil person. God, that sucks so bad, my cat! Oh, oh that she had to put the letter of the cat, oh god. I didn't even name him! I didn't even name him! I didn't even name him! Oh, I can't name him now because he's gone! I'm making money off of him! Ah, oh, God, what would I have named him? I'll let you guys name him because I'm obviously too much of an evil person to name him. Oh, 
Ah, God, it's so horrible. And why is that a thing? I guess I'll get more cat fur once I'm done with this one, or maybe the tin can will be good. Ugh. I don't even know what the tin can does. Oh, it's game. Oh. See what it does. Hey, why not? Oh, God, more mail. What the hell does a tin can do? See, you're making so, so much money now. Great. What? What's it? Is that literally it? It's a tin can. And I bang on it. That's it? Oh, wow. There's no point to that. There's no point. There's no point to any of that. There's no point to having that. Oh. Uh, okay. More cat fur. Oh boy, more mail from Madame Sinclair. Whoa. I wasn't Dr. Money. <gasps> from the desk of Dr. Money. I regret to inform you of a recent New East-West conflict arising in the interest of the economy. We ask you kindly for money? What? How am I supposed to give you money? And why would I give you money? Dr. Money, you're more evil than I am. I thought I was Dr. Money. Wait a minute. Something ain't right here. Something ain't right here. I don't like this. Well, I didn't like it before, but now I like it even less. Uh, just gonna wait it out. Just gonna wait it out. Wait it out. Okay, I got a lot of money again. Ah, oh, come on, they didn't do anything? Uh, how much cat fur do I need to put in there? My poor kitty cat! It wasn't even like an adult cat, he was a little baby, and I sent him out to get money? Who does that? And what cat would do that? That was a gift. It's a glorious gift. I guess I could buy more stuff. Money machine, blam. Yay, I did it. I did the good thing. What else you got for me? From the desk of Dr. Money. That looks like a guy screaming up there. Just send us a letter with the money so the economy can breathe new air and breathe new money. We are waiting. Well, who am I? Who the hell am I that you're gonna ask me? And what is this obscure, vague bull? You send us a letter with the money. Whatever money I want to send so the economy can breathe new air and breathe new money. We are waiting. Well, good sir, I hate to inform you that all of this money is mine. I had to sacrifice a very lovely cat to get it. And for some reason, he had an unlimited supply of fur, blood, and whiskers, along with Topaz. Don't know what money machine I have, but it's glorious. <laughs> what do you want? Madam Sinclair? Why aren't you replying to my letters? Okay, this is a presentable liberty situation. I'm in a room alone! Sorry, ukulele. I'm in a room alone! And I can't do anything to send you a letter. I don't know how. And the game maker decided that this is how this should be. So maybe you should just deal with it. I guess. Oh, another letter, good! Uh, we have noticed a distinct lack of you sending us money for the good of the economy. The East-West conflict has spread to the Far East now. Oh no! Thanks to me. Who am I? Who, who am I? Who am I? Who, who the hell am I? What the hell is the East-West conflict? And those poor East bastards. And those poor rich West bastards. The poor all of the bastards. I don't know. What the hell is happening? Oh, ah, ah. Well, I sure am getting a lot of money now. Maybe I'll get more cat fur. 
Oh, no letters! Good! That's just, just what I wanted. Uh, is there anything else I can buy? Anything at all? Maybe something to advance the story a bit? Oh, look! I advanced the story a bit. From the desk of Dr. Murray, consider this your last warning. If you continue your incompetence, you will be missed. By who? Who's gonna miss me? Apparently I have no friends. Madame Sinclair has, like, killed my cat, and I don't know what I'm supposed to do. She's obviously not my friend, and you aren't either. Only money is my friend. Okay. Blam! All right, what else you got? Madame Sinclair, I even helped you make more money, and still you are ignoring me? Please reply. M.S. No, you killed my cat. And even though I'm using his fur to make more money, that's your fault, not antidote. Enclosed in this letter, you will find a deadly vi- Oh! <laughs> you can buy the- an antidote- Oh! This is how it all started! You can buy an antidote in the shop for money. How much money? Oh, only all of my money. No, sir, not gonna happen. I'm gonna keep all of my money. I don't care if I die. I keep my money. Yes. I can buy another upgrade of cat fur. I can't buy a money machine yet. There's a lot of stuff that I wanna buy, but I'm not gonna buy that antidote because screw him. Hey, look at that! Alrighty. Madame Sinclair. Fine, goodbye. Fine, goodbye, I guess. Thanks for killing my cat. Uh, what else can I buy? Bills, yes, uh, yes. Oh, Dr. Money, yes! We have noticed that you have not bought the antidote yet. We are obligated to remind you that failing to buy the antidote might result in death. Well, too bad for you. I'm not giving you my money. Bury me in all my money. It's mine forever and ever. Even though I'm kind of also being buried in my dead cat's fur. But that's beside the point. At least I have my money. Topaz? Mail! It's mail time. Mail time. The East-West conflict has ended. There are not enough people left to fight for the respective cardinal direction. In light of these new circumstances, we have lowered the price of the antidote. Oh, thank you, Al. Oh, thank you. How good for you. I'm still not gonna buy it. You, you didn't lower the... Oh, he lowered the price by like a thousand. Oh, you dick bag. Oh, you bag of asses. Or maybe you didn't. Yeah, you dick bag! You bag of asses! Just buy a little of screw you! Boo you! Okay, anyway, <laughs> moving on. My extreme maturity is gonna guide me through this game. Don't you worry, everybody. I'm gonna make it through. Ow! Ow! <sighs> All right, time for a money machine. Bloop! Well, screw all of you, I didn't need you anyway. I just need my money. And this stupid frickin' antidote that I'm not gonna buy! Not gonna buy it! I don't know if there's an alternate ending where if you buy the antidote, something happens, but I imagine that's not the case. He'll probably just send you a letter that says, you didn't send enough money. And what's probably gonna result out of this is that he's gonna release the virus to everyone. I don't know. God, it's so messed up because this directly correlates. I thought I was Dr. Money because all of, the, all of this money that I was getting, but Dr. Money is just trying to screw everyone else out of their money. I didn't do a damn thing. I was just trying to make money. I didn't kill my cat. I'm just a victim of circumstance. I just happened to use my cat for more money. And he was dead. Oh. Damn, Dr. Money has been pretty silent. Is nothing gonna happen unless I buy that damn antidote? Because if I do, I'm gonna do when I have like two cents. I'm not gonna give him much. Not gonna give him much. I'm gonna buy the topaz, and if I don't get a letter, I'll buy it. Whoa! Whoa! Oh no! Oh no, you did not! Thank you for your business! 
Thank you very much for screwing me over. Are you still alive? Yes? God, where'd all these letters come from? All I know about you is your address. I don't know how you got that in the first place, but it's a slew of action right now. <laughs> Perhaps it's time I came to visit you. All of my family has succumbed to the deadly v Oh no! It's not a prequel, it's happening at the same time! Oh no! We regret to inform you that the antidote is not working as intended. Uh, the antidote seems to not only stop the virus, but also prevent the functioning of various vital organs. We have a new business offer for you. We will buy any and all vital organs people can give us. We have noticed that the organs you are supplying to us are of suboptimal quality due to their organs being a strange magical money machine. <laughs> their origins. Anyone who gets an implant dies after two hours have passed. Okay. Due to this inconvenience, we can now only sell them at a low price. We hope you can rectify this issue by maybe selling us some of your family and friends' organs. Ah! Grant! It's a horror show! Oh, why? Oh, the humanity! Oh, this is, this is horrifying. I'm sorry I have not come to visit yet. Money is slim and the organs are becoming increasingly expensive. Huh! Oh. Huh! Oh. <laughs> Ah! Why? Why is any of this anything? Why is all of this anything? Ah! Ah! <laughs> what the hell? What the hell, everybody? God damn, what's come next? Okay, nothing! I uh, hope the old day. Oh, boy. I have so much money. I just use it to buy more money. Hey, look, mail! Oh, I literally- Oh, I've maxed out my money machine. Good! Nice tin can. Thanks! What? What? Thank you, I guess? I don't know! What the hell? It's a great tin can. It's the best tin can in all the land. Uh... Oh. Oh. oh, look, more mail! Yay! Sinclair, this will be my last letter to you. I cannot find the money to buy working vital organs, so I'll have to settle with the cheap ones. Why do you need to keep buying them? That's horrible! Oh. It was very wonderful to- Oh, God, now you're gonna make me feel bad, but I don't! You killed my cat! You killed my cat! Oh, blame Dr. Money, but also I blame you! <sighs> I blame this magical money machine that I have that just continually pumps out more and more money. I love money, but not that much. We have a gift for you. Oh! Where is it? Where is it? Huh? Where is it? Where is this gift? Is it money? I love some money. Blah, give me all more money. Mm, money, is it money? But before we can reward you, we need to be certain that your production is top notch. Oh, so you need to make sure I max out everything. Is that what you're saying? Well, I'm a brother! I can't even see my mouse really anymore. We will contact you once again your once your machine is fully upgraded. I hope you will survive until then. Maybe I won't. I don't know, man. Dude, I just don't know. I just want to ride this one out. Ah! During this time, I've been playing this for about an hour and 30 minutes. And during this time, I've been responding to comments on the video that I posted this morning. Hooray! Well, I mean, yay for responding to comments, but... Holy crap, this game has been going on longer than Presentable Liberty did. Blam, kabloom, and kabibbly. Just a little more and I'm, oh wait, ah oh, damn it. Just a little more and I'm almost done. 
Uh, save. Oh, I just looked up and realized I had six million dollars, so I think that might be enough money if I only I could find my mouse. There I am. Blam! Blam! Bloom! I did it! From the desk of Dr. Money, yes! What? What is it, you bastard? We have noticed that you now have upgraded your machine to its full potential. Now we need you to make more money. Lots of more money. Thanks! Everybody in the world is dead! We are main! How much longer do I have to wait? You're such a son of a bitch! You're such a piece of poop! Ugh. Whatever! Whatever, how much, how, how much money? I'll just wait. I'll wait. Oh, 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 I did it, I did it. Whoa, uh-oh, 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 uh-oh. Oh boy. Look in the shop for your gift. All you have to do is give us all your money. Well, I don't think that's gonna be a problem. Seems that my money machine only is bouncing around one last heart. And there it goes. All right! Can opener. From a tin can! Thank you for your business. As you have no money, now you are considered worthless to us. Great! For that reason, we will cease all contact with you. Enjoy your can opener. I will. So I just need to get... Okay, take this. Using the can opener, you bought with the last of your money. You open the tin can. It contained beans. Yum! Yum, 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 yum in my tum tum! You, your face lit up and you started eating. The next day, you could feel your organs starting to fail. You, and at the end of the week, you were dead. What? <laughs> oh, man! Ah! I feel like all of my efforts were worthless. Madame Sinclair was never seen again. I'm guessing because she, along with everyone else in the world, died. Dr. Money continued to make more money and was considered the richest person alive until he too died from the virus he created. Yeah! Suck it, dick! That's what you get! That's what you get! God, this is so weird. This all took place at the same time at Presentable Liberty. It's so weird. It's so weird to think about, but this is all in the same vein. It's all happening at the same time, but I don't even understand who I was or why it was happening. It's like money lives through all things. Presentable Liberty like took the human look, took the human point of view of this story. Like it's like the developer made this game and then had an idea to tell it in a different way. Cause I don't even know who I was. Ah, the cat! Ah, the cat! I care about the cat more than anything! I don't care about the money! Uh, everyone dies and everyone's sad, but the cat at least didn't have to die of the virus. Oh, but the cat was brutally murdered by Madame Sinclair! Oh, I just don't care about her because she killed my cat! Uh. Either way, I played this for an hour and 45 minutes. Hope you guys enjoyed the cut down version. There's obviously a lot taken out of this, but just Thank you all so much for watching. Oh, okay. <sighs> Hope you all have a great day. Hope you all have a great night. Forget the horrible memories of this game series. Huh? And as always, I will see you in the next video. Bye-bye! The last very detailed scenario, bring it home. So so in this lake house in upstate New York in the cat skills. Cat skills. Cat skills. <laughs> <laughs> I'm dead. I'm dead! I'm dead! I can't move! Ah! Oh boy. Ah, what is that? Dude! Oh hi.